Oh, can I hear playing Persona 5 War? If you like the video, please like, subscribe, like leave a comment, and don't forget to click the bell for notification. So I really need some money right now. Can you tell me about this easy part-time job? I'm sure you know about it, Ida-kun. Please? <sighs> you don't need my help. A girl like you could probably get a job anywhere, right? Huh? Um, now that you mention it, uh, yes. So, um, what I mean is... This is going south fast. Uh, oh, Francois! Huh? Huh? Hmm? My cat Francois got run over by a car and also has an incurable illness. I need money fast. That's not convincing at all. Is she talking about me? If Francois were to die, I think I'd die too. Probably. Come on, don't talk like that. If you don't like it, then tell me about that easy part-time job. You know something, don't you? Rumors? Was it Nishiyama who... Nishiyama? Oh, uh... Hey, what was... That's... She actually got... Come on. for something, right? Nishiyama? He usually hangs out with Ida. Oh, so you want to ask him about Ida? So that's why to come. I'm sorry. I don't know where he is right now. He usually stays till late, so I think he's probably still somewhere in the school. I'll keep digging around. Well, I'll have to ask. Transfer student, right? You need something? Ida, how do you know about that? Are you doing something, Am? He's been acting really strange lately. Oh, what do you mean? Is he really wrapped up in something shady? One day, the two of us went to Shibuya. And a man approached us over near Central Street. He asked if we were interested in an easy part-time job. Playing Persona 5? I said I wasn't, but Ida was into it. He was asking the guy all sorts of questions. Back for what? Yeah. Yeah, I know the fit in him right now.
I don't know. I was so scared, I ended up going... But according to Ida, it only takes 10 minutes, and is good for people who don't stand out. Ida started spending a lot of money. That's when his strange behavior began, too. But that's all I know. That's enough, right? A man on Central Street, huh? That is suspicious. Maybe he was making him commit crimes? So that means this part-time job is somehow crime-related. It takes ten minutes, is good for people who don't stand out, and involves a small envelope. Does that ring any bells? It's... Like illegal drugs? Maybe they made Ida smuggle drugs for them. That definitely fits with a small envelope. And you can get arrested just for possession. So he is smuggling. This won't be pretty. Come on, let's go back to Lady Anne. We'll ask Ida directly. Fine. I don't want to talk about it here. Let's go somewhere a little quieter. What's up with you? Especially in front of everyone. This voice just yeah, I got a job. So what? Isn't that normal? What are you getting at? How did you? I've only told one person about that. Of all people. I can't believe you were the one to find out. You're right. They told me they had an easy part-time job for me, and I ended up smuggling drugs. All I had to do was put envelopes into coin lockers, and they said they'd give me a hefty paycheck. I didn't know what was in the envelopes, though. So you knew, huh? They started threatening me right after they deposited the money into my bank account. They had pictures of me carrying the goods. Said they'd expose what I did unless I paid them off.
Why are you even asking me this stuff? Are you just gonna use my job to blackmail me too? Never. I see. Well, even if you were planning on doing that, I don't have any money I could... If you're really interested in that job, try heading over to Central Street. That's where they told me about it. I, I told you everything you want to know, right? Can I go? Well then. What can I get you? You wish to perform a fusion. I see. A strong persona indeed. Excessive power only leads to destruction. Not terrible, but not impressive. You can't handle this. 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 Excessive power only leads to... I see. A strong persona indeed. Do you really need this? Looks pretty tough. You, 
You change oh. your mind? Done already? What? It is time, inmate. What else should I be? Please don't take off my mask. Make sure you close up. So humid. Get it. Okay, we're all here. There sure are a lot of high schoolers during the day. They must be targeting them somehow. Finding the specifics may be difficult. With such a crowd, the odds are against us. Right. We're gonna grab him by the tail. You should head over to Central Street, like we planned yesterday.
Oui, let's get going. Let me know if you find any shady people. All right, let's go. Just as we planned. We might end up running into the Mafia. Be ready for anything. Hey, aren't you interested in all the hottest brand names? We're having a special sale just over there. How about you go take a peek? We ordered way too much, so I have a ton left over. My boss will kill me if I go back to him with all these extras. Look, I'll sell them to you for cheap. What do you say? What should we do? It depends on the price, wouldn't you say? Hey, what about you? These are unforgettable deals. Well, that's disappointing. Come back if you change your mind. Come on, the shop's right around here. How about you come take a look? Seems like some kind of sale. You probably shouldn't bother. idea which of these leads are real. Progress toward finding the boss. That's good to hear. Hey, you two got some time? Have it's real easy. Guess you could call it a delivery job. It seems we didn't have to look very hard in the end. You're high schoolers, yeah? Don't you want something more than just your allowances? Hmm. By delivery, do you mean that of suspicious materials? Huh. <laughs> You're a funny girl. So, you won't answer me. Then I was right. What's up with you anyways? Why are you asking all these questions, huh? Oh. Uh... It was all a joke. Why would I get worked up over some dumb kids? Anyways, I can't hang. See ya. Um, if you don't want to deal with us, we could always go see your boss ourselves. You really gonna say that, knowing who he is? <laughs> no way I believe that.
Well, I'm out of here. You guys are annoying me. I'm pretty sure he's part of the Mafia we're looking for. I don't have any proof, though. I tried to trick him into saying something, but he dodged all the traps I was laying down. By the way, thanks for standing up for me. I'm going to go now. That boss seems tricky. And it looks like he taught his subordinates well, too. No wonder the Anyway, you have Though we still didn't end- Let's stop here. to a woman i heard her voice speaking of some girl called looking for you around noon said she's the class president said she's got something that belongs to you she seemed to know you so i gave her your number she must have looked up leblanc's address that need you then again it's a bit What's up? 
Hey, hey. So, we meet again, but my what murky... Speaking of murky, there haven't been any new developments in the Phantom Thief incidents. If they go so far as using calling cards to get attention, I doubt Matarame's case will be the last. What kind of target will they choose next? The Phantom Thieves only target criminals, huh? Is that really true? Supposing it is, there are plenty of villains in the world. How do they choose who to go after? Hmm. Oh, sorry. I have to stay. If you hear any... Aw, for real? We didn't get anything? God, they suck. And we're going nowhere with this. Hey, can't we ask Miss President to change it up? You mean, change our target? Just gotta show our justice to satisfy her, right? There are tons of shitty adults in this world. It's not like it matters who we're going after. She says this is for the students, but I bet it's just so she can go brag about it on college apps. But that mafia is stealing money from kids. We can't just accept that. It doesn't matter who the target came from anymore. Ahn's right. We want to give courage to the weak. Isn't this the perfect target to accomplish that goal? have no talent. Never thought it'd be this noisy if you weren't singing. Anyways, I'm... That's exact... It all comes... If we... There has to be someone who has what we need. That's right! What about that journalist? You mean the woman who was staking out Matarame's house? Oh, yeah! I completely forgot about her! Didn't she give you her card? This is for a rather major publication. Think we can trust her? There's no other way. Okay, let's contact her. Oh, yes. Thank you. He says our time's up. Should we extend it? Happy hour's over, yeah? Eh, come on. Let's just go. <sighs> How wasteful. <sighs> Anyways... Guess we just gotta wait for that journalist to email us back. Let us know ASAP when she responds. Got it? Hey. Mm -hmm. 